Coach Jackson State head coach Mo Williams really looks up to you and respects you. He's been said many times. We've talked to him. What are your thoughts on the job you've done at Jackson State? Super impressed. You know, we played uh, Rice on Wednesday. So yesterday morning, I got all my post-game analysis, all the stuff that I do to present to the team. I wanted to get that done ASAP because I saw where Jackson State won at Missouri. I saw where Jackson State was leading Georgetown at – all these games are road games, obviously. Uh, uh, leading Georgetown and could have won in the final minute. Uh, beat Arkansas State at Arkansas State. So, um, you know, all, all these are games you have to really, really prepare for, but you get a chance to see the other team. You know, and watching and watching Jackson State yesterday, for instance, uh, Chris, they have a, a best player, uh, the Evans kid, and they run multiple, multiple things. Uh, they disguise stuff to get him the ball. Um this is probably offensively the best schemes that we've seen. Um, and I think that's a huge credit to um, uh, Mo. Uh, Mo's a coach. You know, he he is a basketball coach. He does a great job of uh, understanding who his best players are. He gets them the ball in different areas, in different ways. His kids play extremely hard. Uh, they play together. Um, you know, he's at a school where, you know, most people's that have budgets for out of buy games, um, like an American athletic conference, every coach probably had a budget of $500,000 to, to spend on buy games, you know? So how many games will that get you? You know, if you're, if you're frugal and you get the right teams and negotiate, uh, if you're an area where teams can drive to you, you may be able to get six, six or seven buy games out of that. Well, that's the budget you have to go get games. Well, Mo's opposite. He has to go get $500,000. So he's got to play every game on the road. Um, um, so looking at his record, if you're going to evaluate his team based on his record, that's pretty ignorant on your part. His record is never going to be great because he plays everybody on the road. He's already beaten Missouri. Now turn around and look at the teams Missouri's beaten. You know, Missouri's an SEC team that's going to beat a lot of SEC teams uh, this year. Um, uh, TCU's in our conference. TCU had a shot at the buzzer, uh, a controversial shot at the buzzer to beat uh, Georgetown. Well, Jackson State was in a position to beat them. So from our standpoint, we're preparing for these teams. Everybody's already looking at the line on Vegas uh, to tell us who should win and how much buy. That's an alternate world from us. Don't bring that world to me. I have zero interest in that world. Uh, my daughter Lauren was telling me, somebody told her tonight, well, here's what the line was in Vegas. I have no idea what the line is. You think I look at that stuff or care about it? Uh, zero interest in it. I know how good Jackson State is. I watch them. I prepare for them. I have to take that information to our kids and get them ready for it. So, um, but I'm glad you asked that question, Chris, because um, um, I'm really impressed with Mo. He's done a good job. You can see why his team is is what they are. 